Welcome to part three of my clan generator challenge. If you haven't seen part one and or part two, I suggest going to watch them to see the other cats that I have designed for this clan. Anyway, let's get on to talking about the apprentices of Cliff Clan. First, we have Crowpaw. She was described as a black mackerel tabby she-cat with curly fur and gold eyes. I ended up adding some cream tabby patches to her so that she could have a bit of her father's colors as well. Crowpaw is one of the youngest apprentices along with her brother, Shadowpaw, and is one of Cormorant Star and Sandtail's kits. Crowpaw is mentored by Blackberry, and the two of them get along well, but Crowpaw sometimes feels like she isn't learning much from the other she-cat. She wants to show her clan that she can be a good warrior someday, but she isn't really sure how to prove herself yet. Next, we have Sleet Paul. He was described as a blue spotted tabby tom with short fur and amber eyes. I ended up giving him some larger white patches because I just thought it looked nice. Sleet Paul is the oldest apprentice in Cliff Clan and is looking forward to taking his warrior assessment soon. He's the apprentice of Marigold Throat and is constantly trying to get his mentor to stop being so mean to the cats of Lowland Clan. He likes to help out around camp and take care of the elders when he's not training. And he loves to listen to the stories of when Sandtail and Starlingheart were young warriors. The next apprentice is Eelpaw. She was described as a short-haired white she-cat with a chocolate and red spotted calico tail and ears and copper eyes. Eelpaw is a rebellious apprentice and likes to cause problems around camp when she's bored. She's the apprentice of Chantrell Pelt and the two of them are constantly getting in trouble. She often wonders what her warrior name will be, but she knows that she's got a lot more training ahead of her before her assessment. Up next is Shadowpaw, Crowpaw's brother. He was described as a short-haired black tom with hazel eyes. Shadowpaw is the other kit of Cormorant Star and Sandtail, and is the apprentice of Daceberry. Daceberry and Shadowpaw love to fish for minnows in the creek that run through the territory when they get finished with training for the day. He's a rather quiet cat and likes to spend time alone when he's been around other cats for too long. He's friends with the Lowland Clan apprentice, Squirrel Paul, and the two Toms like talking to one another at gatherings or when they pass by each other on a patrol. The next cat is Gorse Paul. She was described as a chocolate and red classic tortoise tabby she-cat with short fur and amber eyes. Gorsepaw is the sister of Nightpaw and one of Starling Heart's kits. Her mentor is Fennelleg, but she doesn't really like her all that much. She feels that Fennelleg is a little too friendly to other cats and should be a little more protective over Cliff Clan's territory. The young cat would love to grow up to be leader one day, but she's not really sure how to achieve that. And finally, we have Nightpaw. She was described as a black and red mackerel tortoiseshell she-cat with short fur and copper eyes. She's the sister of Gorsepaw and one of Starling Heart's kits. Her mentor is Embertail and she really enjoys training with her. She is quickly becoming an excellent hunter and is known for bringing back prey every time she's on a hunting patrol. Nightpaw was almost made into a medicine cat apprentice, but she didn't feel like it was the right path for her and was instead made into a warrior apprentice. Well, that's all the apprentices. Only one part left for this challenge, and then it'll all be over. I will continue to post content about these cats after the challenge is over, but I can't say when any of that stuff will come out, because I'm not really sure how long it'll take me to do. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed!